His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, was a pure devotee of Lord Krishna, and therefore his entire life, including his passing from this mortal world, was a perfect example of Krishna consciousness. This video depicts his final pastimes. During his last months in Vrindavan, His Divine Grace continued to instruct His disciples, discuss the affairs of ISKCON, and translate Srimad Bhagavatam. On His request, His disciples maintained 24-hour kirtan and readings from the scriptures. Srila Prabhupada invited all His disciples to be with Him as He passed the test we all must face. However, due to circumstances often beyond their control, most of his disciples were not present. Now, those who choose to can experience those precious moments. Although these scenes can be emotionally wrenching, they do depict a rare transcendental event, the last chapter in Srila Prabhupada's glorious life. The final lesson Out of many thousands of men, one may endeavor for perfection. And among many millions who have achieved perfection, one may be a devotee of Lord Krishna. Such a devotee who is fully peaceful is extremely rare. Being situated in his original Krishna conscious position, a pure devotee does not identify with the body. Such a devotee should not be seen from a materialistic point of view. Indeed, one should overlook a devotee's having a diseased or infirm body. According to ordinary vision, such imperfections may seem prominent in the body of a pure devotee, but despite such seeming defects, the body of a pure devotee cannot be polluted. It's exactly like the waters of the Ganges, which remain pure, although filled with bubbles, foam, and mud during the rainy season. Those who are advanced in spiritual understanding bathe in the Ganges without considering the condition of the water. Since we cannot visually experience the presence of the Supersoul, out of His immense compassion, the Supersoul appears before us as a pure devotee, the spiritual master. Such a spiritual master is as worshipable as Krishna is, for in His dealings there are no activities but those of transcendental loving service to the Lord.
The verdict of all revealed scriptures is that by even a moment's association with a pure devotee, one can attain all success. That moment is human society's greatest treasure. Seeing the spiritual master with devotion and reverence is the perfection of one's eyesight. Touching his lotus feet is the perfection of the sense of touch. And glorifying his qualities is the tongue's real activity. And then that karma is tad de de hopa love de hetu. Yeah. And uh, according to the association of um, different nature, we get a body. Karanam guna sangasya sata sat janma yoni. Therefore, we should always seek good association, devotee association. Then on, life will be successful. And then last it says the gunas, satvadayo, uh -huh. jnana vikshepa moha hetavaha. Uh -huh. Yeah, no, if we live with good association, then we cultivate knowledge. Uh, that means association. A man is known by his company. So, if we have the chance of association, with devotees, then our character, teacher, may long depart. By hearing, by discussing Srimad Bhagavatam, this Rajagun Tamagun has subdued. Then Satagun remains Nasta Prayas of Adve, Nistam Bhagavata Then Satagun Tamagun cannot do us harm. Therefore, Varnasam Dharma is so essential that people remain in Sattva. Mm. Uh, Samagam, Rajagam, Rajasthan Bhava increases lust and greediness and that implicate 
the living entity to exist in this material world in many, many forms. That is very generous. Therefore, uh, they should be brought into Satyagun, that is, establishment of Varnasana. How to bring people in Satyagun? Uh, in Brahminical qualification, very neat and clean, rise all in the morning, this Mangalal in this way, to stay in Satyagun. The body, mind, and senses of the pure devotee, acting only for the satisfaction of the Lord, are transcendental and are taken charge of by the Supreme Personality of Godhead. Being awake to his constitutional position, the pure devotee is situated in samadhi, the highest perfectional stage of yoga. Being fully absorbed in devotional service, he does not care what is going on with the external body. Such a confidential devotee of the Lord sees in every moment, even a most difficult moment, the special mercy of the Lord. Pure devotees are themselves places of pilgrimage. Because of their purity, they are constant companions of the Lord. And therefore, they can purify even places of pilgrimage. For such a pure devotee, there is no difference between living and dying, because in this life, he engages in pure devotional service. And after giving up his body, he engages in the same service in the spiritual world. Thus, his devotional service is never hindered, nor does he perceive the pangs of death. The pure devotee does not forget Lord Krishna, even for a moment. And Lord Krishna never forgets his devotee. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama. Every learned man knows very well that attachment for the material world is the greatest entanglement of the spirit soul. But that same attachment, when applied to the spiritual master, opens the door of liberation. The spiritual master's eternal occupation is to expand the service of the Lord by training his disciples in a service attitude. This service attitude, along with knowledge of Krishna, is such a great gift 
that it is impossible to repay the benefactor. Our dear Lord, O Supreme Personality of Godhead, because our association with material desires, one after another, we were gradually falling into a blind well full of snakes, following the general populace. But your servant, Srila Prabhupada, kindly accepted us as his followers and instructed us how to achieve the transcendental position. Therefore, our first duty is to serve him how could we leave his service?
हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 Oh, 
Srila Prabhupada was the crown jewel on the head of this world. Without him, this world is bereft of its valuable ornament. Yet, in Srila Prabhupada's absence, there is no need to become despondent, because there is no difference between Srila Prabhupada's instructions and Srila Prabhupada himself. He is personally present in his instructions. In his absence, therefore, Srila Prabhupada's words of direction are the pride of his followers. Their implicit faith in his words is their success. O virtuous devotees, thus we have seen the departure of Srila Prabhupada and this is just to increase our desire for him, because the more we hanker for him, the more we will be freed from all material desires. Mm-hmm. 